Hey guys, welcome on in. Kiros here. I'm going to show you how to get all those new items in patch 1.1, especially the items that are going to help you out throughout your gameplay from the condensed resin to the teleporter to all those other new items. So let's go ahead and check that out. We're going to keep this short and sweet. All right, guys, now all the items that you're looking for in patch 1.1 come from two different vendors in each of the cities. There's one vendor in uh, in the first city. There's one vendor in the second city. City. So now half of the items are on one vendor and half the items are on another vendor. So there is some priorities that you're going to have to do with repping up your reputation when doing these vendors. So let's go ahead and see where these vendors are real quick. Here's the vendor for Liui, the secretary ministry of civil affairs you find her right around the corner here and she gives you access to all of that reputation and all of those items you can earn all right so some of the items you're looking for are from this reputation in the bottom left hand corner but you should note a couple of things here one you're going to get a decent amount of reputation levels by just doing world exploration and some quests so if you've been playing the game you're probably going to get to level two level three pretty easily but as we start to look at the items, you're going to need to prioritize which reputation you're going to want to do first because your bounties and your requests are shared between all cities. So you have to make, you have to choose which one you want to do uh, first and which one you want to do second. Now, I highly suggest that you do Liyui's bounty up until level three first in order to get that condensed resin. Now, once you're at level three, you're automatically going to get that geo finder. So that's probably the thing that most players are concerned with. They're trying to find all those geo, uh, geo coolis. I can never pronounce that out in the world. They haven't found all 131 in the second city. So you're going to get that at level two anyways, but the rewards that you get at level four, five, and six are not as good as the first cities. Being able to find those geo coolest and make condensed resin is going to make a, it's going to be a big quality of life. So let's head on over to the other city now. All right, heading on over to Monsat, you can find a similar vendor in the city. If you go to your city map, you'll find it in sort of the middle top corner, if that makes sense. But you can see it here on the map. I have it circled. And then you just got to head on over to this reputation vendor in order to start buying all those other items that you want to get now it's important to note that i am reputation level three already which is going to get you some of those items but you mainly get reputation three from world exploration and doing the quest you want to be very careful that you're using your bounties correctly and using your requests correctly because they are shared across all cities so you can only do x amount per city every week so if you're trying to focus on one city versus another because there's an item you really want to get you want to take that into consideration and you can see it marked here that it applies to all cities all right the reason i say that monstat is better is because you get the meal activatable button so you can use meals while you're in combat you can get the waypoint so you can put out waypoints in the world and be able to teleport those to wherever you want and you also get the wind catcher which is going to allow you to traverse the world a lot faster I wouldn't worry too much about the wings. Um, you'll get those over time, but you really want to focus on those items first because they're really going to accelerate your experience in the game. The reputation here, you're, you're obviously going to see that a lot of it's going to come from your world exploration. You're going to get just base EXP for that reputation level from doing 20, 40, 60. A lot of it's going to come from the quest. You can see as you're just doing the quest, you're going to get a lot of those as well. Now, doing some soft, Mapkin, napkin math and we'll get into this in another video it i think it's going to take roughly six weeks to complete either one vendor or both vendors guys correct me in the uh in the comments down below but it might be six weeks per vendor i need to go over the i need to go over the details in that we'll do that in another video on how to optimize um granted it's not that complicated of a process so maybe not but this is why i say you you have to focus on one city at a time up until the point that you get the item you want i'd say bring both cities to three 
And then once once you're done getting him the three, focus on Mondstadt and then make your way back over to Louis. I would not focus on the wings. That should not be your priority. Your priority should be getting all the blueprints you can. All right, guys, I hope that helped out my new players and uh, maybe mid-range players and stuff like that. If you guys have any more questions, hit me up on my Twitch.tv channel. Come hit us up on the Discord. I do appreciate you. I'll see you on the next video. <laughs>